Welcome to Mesa, Arizona for the start of the 2019 Northwestern baseball season. We, we talked about it in the fall. It's not just you, right? Brave, courageous, determined, intention, devotion, okay? were all some of the words that we talked about, okay? And again, you, you think about those and you think about what that, you know, what, what those words mean and, and each each one of us, okay, it's kind of has our, our different, you know, battles from our senior that, that's done this to, to the freshman that, that this is their first experience, okay? But all I'm gonna say, right, when we're talking about being courageous is it's not just for you, right? But it's to the guy to the right and left, you and it back. 56 plus games. Okay, let's let's see what, what it's all about. Just really excited, a lot of energy around this team, and, and the team's motto this year, you know, they just have the 64 plastered everywhere, kind of their, their theme of the year, and let's be one of the best 64 teams in baseball. So that's the goal for Spencer Allen and his ball club, and it's a, a young team that's returning a lot of talent. They return more starting pitching, more pitching than any team in the country, really. Basically, everyone is back. The core of their team is back. This is a talented Northwestern team, to say the least. We got a little pregame catch rolling with the best catch partner in the country, Charlie Maxwell. Iron Cat here for a senior campaign, squaring up some baseballs in beautiful Arizona. What, what are you feeling about today's game? Give me a little something. Give me a catch, dog. Okay. You know, a lot of two-out RBIs. Yep. And clean defense. Just a lot of letting it eat. You gotta let it eat. Two. Coming. Oh, we'll smell ya. Let's go, show us the juice. Let's see the juice, baby. Northwestern, this is Spencer Allen's fourth season in charge of the the ball club. Okay, under control, okay. Working, working our, our footwork, handle the baseball, okay, make sure we got good eye contact when we're throwing the baseball, especially you middle guys, not just spinning and throwing. Let's just make sure we got good eye contact with everything. Okay, hey, let's go. Have a little fun, set the tone. Let's go, let's go. Let's do it. Northwestern up to bat for the first time. Jack Dunn leading off. Again, he's the leadoff hitter for Northwestern. As he goes, the rest of the team goes. Emotional leader as a senior. Hit over 300 last year leading the team. This is part of the opening weekend for the Wildcats. They have three against BYU. They really just want to attack from the very first inning, very first pitch. Hey, not, not a lot to say, okay? Let's just bring it in, let's get after it, okay? Have some fun, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, get this thing together, ready? One, two, three. I said together! No, you said let's do this together. Let me take over. Let's go! One, two, three. Yes! yes. Together. <laughs> Come on! Wow. Again, it's just opening weekend. A lot of baseball left to be played this season. You hear them refer to the Big Ten as a new season. But right now, this is all they have on their docket deck. We'll see what Northwestern can do. The 
Wildcats trailed early in this game after BYU took the lead after the first inning. Good job, come on! Cougar starter Jordan Wood was throwing his best stuff, but Northwestern finally managed to knock him out of the game this inning. Now Leo Kaplan digs into the batter's box. Western's junior Friday night pitcher just finished off six innings with just one run allowed, looking like his freshman year self out there. He's now in line for the win. Good, that boy. Hey, get it around. Get quick out here now. Hey, ready to make a play right here. Heading to the middle of the eighth inning, and the Wildcats are looking good in this one. Defensively, they've handled every ball that BYU has put in play. Leo Kaplan even robbed a would-be home run at the fence. Northwestern with the bats, they finally got going. They were persistent, but eventually they kept pounding and pounding away, and now they have a lead. They had a 3-1 lead, but in the eighth inning, BYU rallied to tie things up. It went to the 10th, and Northwestern had two men on in the top of the 10th inning. They couldn't score, and after Nick Pachori came into the game to try to salvage things, BYU eventually walked it off. They really just want to attack from the very first inning, very first pitch, and get back on track against the Cougars. Sam Lawrence opens his account with a swinging strikeout. Full count, swung on and missed. He's sailing for four and four with innings. But no. Turek up still the off the pitch. Mm. The Wildcats win three, two. They take game two of this series. Today, they take on the Cal Golden Bears. Sends it out to left center, right center field. It's back, it's at the wall. And the Wildcats win. Nick Coley gets the job done. <laughs> hey, hey, that, that's for me right there, guys. That, that's the, the formula, right? So, hey, proud of this group right there, okay? Two and two on the weekend after, you know, not, not so hot yesterday. That's, that's good stuff right there, okay? That, that, that's really, really good stuff.